Hello folks, welcome to Sherwood Park Toledo, located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. Today I'm going to be showing you this new Toyota Tundra Tier D Off-Road. Now the most suitable features on this Tier D Off-Road is its parking sensors. You have your power moonroof along with your heated front seats. Now I'm going to go through a couple more features on the inside and outside of the vehicle just to get you better familiar with this new Toyota Tundra Tier D Off-Road. Let's get started. Now a couple of the exterior features that you will see on this Tier D Off-Road is its daytime running lights. You also have your fog lamps and then taking a closer look just at your front bumper you're going to see your plug-in block heater. You also have your parking sensors and over on the side you have the 18 inch aluminum alloy wheels. Up top you have your foldable mirrors as well as your heated mirrors. and taking a look here you have the smart key system with it so with the smart key system you can lock all the doors simultaneously just by pushing on the two little lines you see there on the handle push it on once it'll lock all the doors automatically and then if you put your hand between the handle it'll unlock the front door for you as well now this is all possible just as long as you do keep the key fob on you at all times and the color we're going to be taking a look at today is cement now to start off with we're going to be taking a look at your front dash as well as your front seats just so you have a much better idea of how much space there is you have your black lock into your seat surfaces with your power driver's seat with lumbar support. Over on your left hand side you're going to see your mirror controls along with your automatic headlights and your open and close for your power rear window. Window locks, power locks, and window controls both your front and rear windows. Now a couple of the controls you'll see here on the steering wheel include your seat function, volume control, voice recognition, mode select, Bluetooth, lane departure alert, scroll function for your multi-informational display, and your cruise control. Now it does offer you the push button start, so all you have to do is push your foot on the brake, hit the push button, and it will start up you automatically. Now, taking a look at the multi-informational display, you'll see a couple of different features on here, which include your digital speedometer with the distance to empty. You also have your trip info on here. Up at the top of the screen you have an exterior temperature gauge, you can take a look and scroll through the audio as well as your lane departure alert, tire pressure monitoring, trailer brake, messages, and your settings menu with your lane departure alert, pre-collision system as well as a couple of other additional features. Now just down below on your right hand side you're going to see your tow haul and your trailer brake. Taking a closer look now at the center dash as well as the display, or I should say touch panel display you'll see a couple of different features on there so if you go inside the menu screen you'll find your audio phone apps as well as a couple of other additional features with the apps menu this is part of the Entune app suite so as long as you have it on your phone you can use such apps as the Scout GPS app which allows you to stream your maps from your phone onto the touch panel display you can also check on local fuel prices or on the latest sports scores just depending on what your preferences are it is compatible with Apple CarPlay and you have the Sirius XM satellite radio 4x4 select, hazard lights, dual zone climate control settings. Underneath you have the USB and auxiliary input with your traction control on and off, parking sensors on and off, heated seat controls, and your power outlet. Now it's mounted to an automatic transmission. And taking a look just at the top here, you have your auto dimming rear view mirror with integrated garage door opener and digital compass. And you'll find the open and close as well as the tilt up and down feature for the power moonroof with the SOS Safety Connect, so in the event you're in a collision and you're unable to respond, emergency services will be sent out to you right away just to make sure you're okay. You have the sunglass case holder up there as well, and I'm just going to throw this into reverse just so I can show you the backup camera. So as you can see, you have those nice guiding lines in there, making things much easier for you when you back into a stall, or if you're hooking up your trailer. Finally, we'll be taking a look at your rear cargo bed as well as your tailgate. Now located on your rear bumper, you're going to see your parking sensors just located right across. The nice thing is you have a three-piece bumper, so in the event that you damage the one section, you just have to replace the one segment. Connectors for your towing, spare tire will be located underneath your rear bumper, and then you have the backup camera as well as the lock for the tailgate. Now closing in on the rear cargo bed, as you can see you have the bed rail system, so with the bed rail system you can readjust those cleats that you see on either side there. Place them all on one side of the bed rail system or take them out all together just depending on what your needs are for. Over on the left, as well as on the right, front, and back side, you're going to see a couple of areas where you can tie down some loose cargo, just so it's not shifting around in the back of your bed while you're driving. Thank you so much, folks, for watching this video today. If you have any questions, please visit us. We're located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. Phone number is 780-410-2455, or please visit our website at sptoyota.com to get us by email. 
Once again, folks, thank you so much for watching this video today. If you have any comments or any additional questions, please leave them in the comment section located down below. Other than that, make sure you have a great day, and I hope to see you next time.